Right, hello everybody. I am recording some more blogs and of course somebody is going to be very happy because they love my blogs basically and she was always asking when or or basically when am I going to be recording them and uploading them. And I basically say I'm doing them soon or I'm doing them very um or tomorrow or whenever, you know, I always say that just keep an eye out and that's what I normally do I don't have a set time of when I'm going to do them I sometimes record three or four or five in a row and then upload them not in one go because that's not me I don't want to sit there and upload four videos at one time I want to do one video upload it and then I've got three ready to go for the next time now the purpose of this one is about weather yes um, as many people may know Living in England, or the UK, brings out the crazy weather. I don't know any country in the world that has four seasons in one day. Maybe they do, maybe they don't. Um, a lot of people would say, you know, well we complain about it being too hot. Um, a lot of times people will say, try living in, say, America. And I understand that, I understand that because I've been to America and I've had the pleasure of being in the Florida weather and it's been hot there but the difference between Florida and the UK is that the hot weather is Florida may be hot and you can understand that but you don't sweat so much the humidity is different and everything is different about it um, the thing that I find with the crazy British weather is basically it's hot basically it gets hot you sweat more but we still get we still get rain I could be sitting here, as I am now, doing this video, and I am hot. It is basically warm. And yet, outside, it's raining. Showers. That is how crazy the British weather is. Right? Usually I'm expecting, when it's raining, I'm expecting cold, damp. But this is not what happens in the summer. Basically, you're living in England, it can rain, and basically you still get the hot weather. I've said many times on possibly blogs or videos or whatever that I'm not a big fan of the summer. But I don't hate hot weather. I don't really, really hate it. I mean, it'd be, it'd be something to think about. Because if I sat down and said I hate all hot weather and I don't want to see it again, would be basically crap. Snow, yes. If I never see snow again, I'd be happy. That would be something I would say, nah, I'm not bothered about snow. It could just... But hot weather, I, I, I don't really, really like it too hot, but I don't mind having having it, because I don't mind going out, and I, and I do, um, you know, and I, and, and I do think that when there are certain things on, you know, whether we're going to a music festival or whatever it's going to be, then I don't mind. I don't mind going out in the hot weather, and I don't mind it being a bit like that, because what's the, what's the problem? I usually want to go and do things, I might be going around the shops or town or whatever. So it's not really going to be something that I'm going to think about. I'm going to think, oh, it's too hot because, you know, I'm going to be walking in and out of shops, you know, I might not get sunburnt easily compared to some people because they're out there basically sunbathing and things like that. So it doesn't bother me as, you know, like, um, some. So I don't mind a bit of it. I do prefer cooler weather, but... The only, thing I the only thing I hate the most about the hot weather is having to use a fan all the time. We don't have air conditioning in our, in our room, so we've always got to use a fan. No question about that. I can't imagine not sitting here with a fan not being on. And then, of course, you go to bed and you're hot. But then again, I'm lucky because I can go to bed and I can sleep like a log. So I'm not always constantly waking up. So that's not a bad thing for me. I'm not complaining about that. I don't, you know. So yeah, it's not it's not too bad. And I guess the only thing with and, and I would say I'd wear shorts in the hot weather, but the problem is um, going out wearing shorts isn't always easy because I would have nowhere to put my iPod or phone or anything. Um, which is exactly why I like to wear trousers with pockets and they have some zips because it's not safe, you know. I mean, I don't know about you lot, but I don't take a bag out with me all the time. I'm not going to 
carry um, a bag, even though I could do. I don't see the point. If I'm going to go out there and I've got my um, trousers on with basically um, a zip pocket, then I could put my key in there and my phone and my iPod and that kind of thing, and maybe any money because. If I had to go out there, if I had to go out there in the hot weather and I've got my shorts on and I've got no zips on it or anything like that, people might say, well, where am I going to carry everything, you know? I'm going on the bus and I've got a bus ticket. It's something that needs to be thought about. And one, one thing also about um, the weather, I don't mean the hot, the hot weather, but with the um, rain, is it always interrupts with, um, basically, um, TV. Because we have Sky and the always talk to Sky it always turns it off basically so you don't get a satellite signal. But it comes back after a while. Um so yeah. And just before I wrap this up, um TV's on and an advert has just come on for now eighty eight, so yep, ka ching yep. The long, the long line of series of music CDs that basically are coming out. So yeah. Um, so anybody watching this, and particularly a certain person, she knows who she is. She'll be happy, and hopefully um, she might enjoy what I've got to say and things like that. And get, and that people have their own views on what we do. Do you like the hot weather better than say the colder weather? Do you prefer snow? Maybe. In fact, it is actually thundering and lightning out there, so. And considering we've got, yes, hot weather and there's some rain, there is um, thunder and lightning, so that's what I say, crazy British weather, but we'll leave it at that because I've got a few more blogs to do after this. Uh, bye for now.